Hey guys, Vince here. Uh, doing some more orb shots here, orb videos. I just did a bunch of EVPs. It's about, it's getting close to light actually out. It's about 6.45, something like that in the morning. And the orbs are still flying, of course. It seems like they're always flying around here. Um, did some cool EVPs. Um, oh, that's a good one there. Um, have two or three different types of apps and voice recorders, etc. cetera. Um, I haven't got anything really awesome yet. Um, sometimes you'll get that weird clicking noise, you know. Um, I don't know if you, anyone who's done EVPs out there, you will hear some weird shit on there, I'll tell you what. Um, I've got that weird clicking noise. I've got some really loud, loud, it sounds like somebody hitting a big staple gun with their, you know, ka -chink, that kind of ka -chink noise. Um, I haven't got no voices yet, honestly, but I really haven't done many EVPs really hardly at all. I'm more into the camera more than anything, as you can tell. Um, but, uh, oh, look at that one. That was an awesome pink one. Wow. So yeah, they're active. Um, damn, there's some good ones. So yeah, what I do is I just, uh, I put one device in here, do like a 10 minute session. Sometime I'll just leave, uh, leave it running. I really won't even ask questions. I'll just ask for any spirits around to leave me a message in it on the recorder. And while I'm leaving one device in here, I was in the bathroom listening to the other device, you know. So basically I'll put my phone in here um, and record EVP with it, with my app or with the uh, voice recorder that's built into the phone um, with some really good orbs. And then I'll take my voice recorder in there and I'll listen, you know, listen to the one I just recorded. And I'll just constantly do that back and forth. Um, so while one is recording, I'm listening to the other. <laughs> what a concept, huh? But yeah, I figure, you know, I can, there's nothing worse than doing a bunch of EVPs and just letting them pile up and pile up. And then before you know it, you've got fucking hours of EVPs to listen to. So, uh, that was a really cool pink orb I caught earlier, man. I'm like, that was groovy. Groovy, man. Psychedelic. <laughs> I won't go there. So anyway, this is going to be another orb video. Um, <clears throat> the pink one was really cool. Any spirits around here? You want to show yourself in front of the camera? Haha. <laughs> yeah, I'd be so lucky, huh? <laughs> um, it's past witching hour here, guys. Even though it really doesn't matter. Spirits are around us all the time, I believe, day and night. Um, they supposedly seem to be more active at night. Um, and I really haven't caught any orbs on video during the day just because of the light factor, you know? You need to have a light source. You can't. Normally, you ain't going to see them in broad daylight on video, but I have caught them on camera and on pictures during the day. Um, for the most part, you know, my time is the best, it seems, for any kind of activity. Um, what we got going on? Orbs, more orbs. Come on, my little orbs. Where are you at? There you are. See? They listen to me. Like I said before, these things look like little UFOs. Not like I've really seen UFOs, but wow, that was a good one. <clears throat> and that's, you know, go ahead and leave me a comment and tell me what you think about them. You know? They're kind of unexplainable, I guess. I know there are, in fact, orbs. Um, I don't know if there are any spirit orbs or human orbs. You know what I mean? From deceased people, um, ghost orbs, whatever you want to call it. I believe I catch those down at Grants Pass. If you look at some of my pictures on the slideshow, you'll see the huge green and blue ones. Um, especially the green ones. I believe those are actually human spirit orbs. It's the same area where I caught all my ghost pics at and uh, a lot of that misty stuff and pla uh, ectoplasm looking stuff. But, uh, you, these things are like pretty awesome though. I like, you can literally follow them sometime because it's just kind of literally, some will shoot by, you know, and some will just zigzag and float around like that one. Um, there's another one shooting by. I'm going to get a different angle here for a change. 
can just do this damn same old angle all the time that I do. There we go. Something different for a change. Oh, got the door shut. I was doing EVP, so I shut the door. We just had a really bad windstorm here. Uh, I had a meeting I was going to go to, uh, but I couldn't go to it last night. And blew the lights out around here. The traffic was backed up like for miles, literally. Um, so I said, the hell with this. I ain't going. It was pretty dangerous too, to be walking down the sidewalk, you know, under. I was going to head over to the bus stop. And pretty dangerous to be walking down the sidewalk when you got power lines flapping and flipping, you know moving really fast above you, bouncing back and forth. <laughs> it's kind of scary. Same with the tree branches. Um, just outside of Portland, Oregon here. Basically around the outskirts I live. And I love this town, man. I love this state, really. Oregon's awesome. Ah, and look at all the orbs we got. You see the fans there. It's very rarely ever cut on. Um, There's another orb video to bore you guys. You know, what can I say? These are invisible to the naked eye. I know I said that before. Um, just like to repeat myself because some people may just look at a few of my videos. You know what I mean? So, but yeah. Um, You can, if you look in front of my camera, if you're actually here with me, you just literally, just billions of these things floating everywhere in front of my camera. But uh, the camera isn't catching every every one of them, of course, as you see. That I can, I mean, but when I look at it with my naked eye, you're just all over the place. Um, the camera is catching, uh, I'd say, plenty of them, as you can tell. I'm going get some noise from the neighbors now. It's like, I don't know, 7 in the morning. <laughs> Sun's going to be coming out soon. I'll probably try some more. Uh, oh, that's a cool one. I'll probably try some more EVPs later during the day. I mean, you never know. Um, you can always take pictures with the cam, too, during the day. Yeah, I can even try some daytime video up here. I don't know. Probably won't catch anything. But like I said, I really don't have any kind of other activity here you know i haven't really i don't i have as you guys know i collect ouija boards ouija boards however you want to say it but uh i very rarely ever use them but i'm probably going to start using them again probably more often it's usually by myself i do my uh ghost stuff pretty much all by myself I go out in the woods sometime by myself late at night and it's creepy man i ain't gonna lie <laughs> I'm a pretty tough guy and doesn't take, I don't get scared very easily, but I'll sit there and watch the most demonic fucking creepiest episodes of the haunting on TV. And I'll go right, try to go to bed right after that. <laughs> wonder why I can't sleep good, huh? But I try not to have much fear, you know, because if you do run into something really bad or evil, which is very rare, but you don't want to show really, of course, everyone's going to be scared, but you don't want to try not to show a lot of fear because they feed off of it and it can actually make things a lot worse. Just got to kind of stand your ground, but you also don't want to be um, aggressive toward it. You know, you see some of the hauntings, you see some people have serious hauntings and they're just so fed up with it. You know, the guy is just lashing out at the spirit because it's like, you know, attacked his family and it's just made chaos in the house. Um, but that's really what you don't want to do. You don't want to try to confront a spirit like that aggressively, angrily, mad. You know, it's just going to make things worse, actually. It's kind of, you got to kind of have a balance if possible. <laughs> but I can understand, you know, if I had a kid and this weird thing or something that was unseen was really, you know, messing with my kid, trying to harm it or hurt it or. Um, even possibly take it over, you know, possession wise, but those things are really rare, but they do happen.
I honestly don't trust a lot of paranormal groups. I know it sounds crazy. I'm definitely not, you know, a total pro at this shit. I'm pretty good at it, I think, sometimes, but I ain't a pro. But I just don't agree on a lot of the paranormal groups. Some of the things they say, I don't even agree on some of those high-tech gadgets they use, really. It's not because I don't have them, but, I mean, I have the essential stuff I need. I have voice recorders. I have um, ghost meters. I have a K2 meter. Um, I have security sensors I can set up. If anything moves or comes near me, they'll go off. Um, they work really awesome. Um, all kinds of, there's, lots of, there's some pretty good apps out, actually. Um, I don't know how legit they are, but um, I have some great voice recorders. Like I said, I have the essential stuff, the basic starter stuff, K2 meter with sound I have. I have my ghost meter. Um, really good cell phone with great apps on it, great camera on it. Um, I also have my digital Nikon Coolpix camera, which I've done tons of video with that. Um, and great pictures. You'll see I've caught my ghost pictures actually with my Nikon camera. My Grants Pass ghost pics that you'll see on my uh, page here, or uh, pardon me, on my channel. Uh, I haven't had much sleep, guys. <laughs> I've been up. Slept a couple hours. I don't know if I'm like 10 to 12, and then I've been up since like 12 o'clock. So it's about 7 in the morning. Anyways, some cool herbs actually in the beginning of this video, and I'm going to go ahead and shoot it to YouTube. And, um, I'll go ahead and stop it at about 12 minutes. <laughs> I think it's enough. Uh, I've got a couple more EVPs I want to listen to real quick, and then I'll probably, I don't know, I could make a cup of coffee or hot chocolate or something, and maybe play some World of Warcraft. World of Warcraft. I am a WoW junkie, so. <laughs> Metal WoW slash Paranormal Junkie. Okay, let's shut this down, guys. We'll see you next video. Peace.